March, the Empire's on the run. Alex Jones and the GCN Radio Network. Using unparalleled research in the development of a synergistic formulation based around the key concepts of super oxygenation, the next level in cleansing is here. With key ingredients backed by real clinical studies, the new Oxy Powder, available through InfoWars Life, was invented during Dr. Group's research on the toxification of our bodies. Many herbal colon cleansers are harsh on the body and contain cheap and potentially dangerous ingredients, oftentimes full of synthetic fillers, GMOs, additives, or worse. Gently start cleaning your body with easy capsules that start working while you sleep. Oxy Powder does not require time off work, and there's no need for bad tasting concoctions. Instead, Oxy Powder slowly releases monoatomic oxygen into the intestinal tract and body. Experience the astonishing cleansing power of superoxide and ozonide technology. Go to InfoWarsLife.com or InfoWarsStore.com to get started with Oxy Powder, or call 1-888-253-3139. Aging starts at the cellular level. When cells become toxic, they die early and aging sets in. In the past decade, we have witnessed unparalleled scientific discoveries. During that period, key patented compounds have focused on mitochondrial growth, nerve growth, and rejuvenation. But no one has put together a formula that focuses directly on brain health, nerve growth factors, and optimizing your cellular energy at the same time. We now have the synergistic solution, DNA Force, just one of the key compounds. BioPQQ is backed by major clinical studies and over 175 PubMed-listed published studies. You want the best that's out there at the lowest price anywhere? The ultimate value, cutting-edge, trailblazing game changer that also supports the info. War. Secure your DNA force today at InfoWarsLife.com or call toll free 888 253 3139. DNA Force from InfoWars Life. When you're out on the road, the last place you want to be is on the road. But if the unfortunate happens, you'll be glad you were wearing diamond gussets. There's a place down in Tennessee. Where they make blue diamond gusset jeans They so pride in every stitch Guarantee you love the way they fit They put a diamond gusset in the crotch Where you need it most Blue diamond gusset's got it Others don't we turn jeans inside out. Diamond Gusset Jeans. Made in the USA with unparalleled quality. Our Defender motorcycle jeans combine gusset comfort with Kevlar protection so you can ride all day with confidence. Order yours at gusset.com. Diamond Gusset Jeans got it. Others don't. You can complain about Big Brother and how this is uh, uh, a potential... Uh, run amok. But when you actually look at the details, then I think we've struck the right balance. And if people can't trust not only the executive branch, but also don't trust Congress and don't trust uh, federal judges to make sure that we're abiding by the Constitution, due process and rule of law, then we're going to have some problems here. The Alex Jones Show, because there is a war on for your mind. We've been conquered. We've been occupied like France by the Nazi Germans. And if we don't wake up and realize that, we have no hope. That's why they have the White House run MSNBC, CNN, and Media Matters publicly run by the White House. Demonizing yours truly because they know the real power of this broadcast is not the 18, 20 million people we reach every week. The real power is that you reach people. And that the information we lay out here now is the talking points for the rest of talk radio and for Congress to a great extent. And that scares them, just like DrudgeReport.com scares them, because Drudge can point at some bill or some obscure video and get a major debate going. That's what we're able to do. So many times. That's why this broadcast is so special. It's a great responsibility. I get excited when I see other alternative media becoming the dominant media, 
breaking big stories. I don't get mad and say, man, I wish we'd have broke that story. The Daily Caller did. Or man, look at the attention World Net Daily is getting. Or man, look at the attention this local talk show host is getting. I get excited that people understand what's going on. I get excited that we're not one of the only organizations out there now that can do this. Because there's safety in numbers, and it means we can win. I want the big win. I don't want to bankrupt the country. I don't want to collapse. I want a future for my children just like you do. I want prosperity. I want justice. I don't want to go quietly into that long night with the New World Order. I mean, look at Jerry Brown preparing to run for president, Breitbart's reporting, and his meeting with donors this week. Talk about nightmarish. Back in 92, he ran with Jesse Jackson. We can put that article up on screen. I mean, that is just simply, simply amazing that that is going on. And you know what? If he's able to get, by the breach in California, another 30, 40, 50 million illegals in and get them all voting cards, and, you know, California gets up to 60, 70 million people, it'll, 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 California will decide the election. Because you only get 100 million people or so ended up voting in presidential elections. California's 37 million right now or whatever it is. I mean, you get set to be like 50 million in a couple of years because it's the North American Union. The globalists are collapsing us into this greater union. And Obama says he's ready with executive action to move forward. Executive order on immigration would ignite a political firestorm. But Obama says he's going to go ahead with it. Now, he lies so much, that tells me he may not do an executive order. May back off. They call it a victory. But already since January, the border's totally wide open. The Border Patrol loads the illegals on Greyhound buses and others and gives them a federal voucher to go anywhere they want in the country. Anywhere. You want to go to upstate New York from Texas? You can. You want to go from California to Maine? You can. You want to go from California to the Keys of Florida? You can. You want to go from California to Minnesota? You can. This is unbelievable. This is or The Border Patrol has gone on Fox television and said, we complete the smuggling process. Exactly what we said from our sources. We showed you the video from McAllen with the emergency manager going, yes, the Border Patrol loads them, gives them vouchers, uh, certif and then lets them go in, kids with their families, under any name they want. Biometric scans are not even taken. When you get a driver's license, biometrics are taken. They said it was for the illegals back in the 90s when Clinton got it put in nationwide. And I told you it wasn't, folks. They just let people in and you can be whoever you want. You want five identities? You want to pull five different welfare roles? Go ahead. When police pull illegals over now on record, they don't even give them tickets because they can't. No ID, no nothing, above the law, not complying. We, though, comply with every form of government abuse, every form of government rape, every form of government shellacking. And so we are the right whale. And again, the right whale was a slow, sweet, fat whale that was almost extincted by the 1960s when hunting it was banned. I think there was like three dozen left or something. One of the most plentiful whales in the ocean. There are three species of large baleen whales of the genus, the North Atlantic whale, the North Pacific right whale, and the Southern right whale. They're classified in the family of the baleen of the bowhead whale. Right whales have round bodies, V-shaped blowholes, and dark gray and black skin. Their most distinguishing feature is the right whale is the rough patches of skin on the head. If you guys read deeper, why they call it the... Oh, there it is. Right whales were the preferred target for whalers because their docile nature, their slow surface skimming feeding behaviors, their tendencies to stay close to the coast, and their high blubber content, which makes them float when they are killed and which produces high yields of whale oil. Today, the North Atlantic and North Pacific right whales are among the most endangered whales in the world. And America, and the average American, is known as the schmuck whale, the joke whale, 
the chump male, the mark whale, the target whale. We are known as the joke of the planet. We are known as the idiots of the world, as I've told you, and as Gruber tells you. Ha, ah, you stupid Americans. Well, who are you working for? <laughs> we can rip you off and keep it secret, and you're so dumb. <laughs> Yeah, I met with Obama, and he said, I can't afford to run this through it. How are we going to hide this? And I came up with a plan of how to deceive everybody. <laughs> and you know what? You are the right whale. Not our general audience, but our new listeners. I'll sit here and tell you, man, you need to wake up. I just played Obama, the Jamie Foxx calls Lord and Savior, saying that open borders would wreck the country and bankrupt us. You better believe that was the plan, Jack. Barack Obama, Barack Obama. Yeah, let's play that again right now. Come on, old, old clip. First of all, give an honor to God and our Lord and Savior, Barack Obama. Barack Obama. Y'all stand up. You know what Jamie Foxx does? He's not stupid. He's made over $100 million. He sits back and knows he's chumping everybody. He knows he's gaming everybody from Texas. He's up from where I'm from. I think he's a good actor. But every time I watch him now, I can't, I have to turn the television off or leave the movie because this is a guy like Zuckerberg who knows that his viewers and his fans are dumb effers. That's another quote. And it's just real funny. Let me tell you, I've been around high-level Democrats. They know it's a chump game. They know their job is to go out there and, and sell everybody that it's cool to be a slave. But Bill Cosby comes out and says Obamacare is bad, Obama's bad, being a black gangbanger is bad, that black leaders want to keep blacks down and basically pimp them, which is the game that Margaret Sanger came up with. And boy, you notice they're going after him now. Doesn't matter there's no evidence, they're going to get him. They're going to get him, they're going to teach him good. You understand that? Until we wake up to it. Until we understand what's happening. I want to get more into Obamacare, more into uh, super bird flu, more on Putin, four killed in chemical leak at L.A. Laporte plant. I said Laporte. I saw L.A. L.A. Laporte plant uh, in Texas. KTRK uh, reports. Well, the answer is ban chemical plants if anyone ever got, got hurt. No, the answer is that's just part of life. And we've got a lot safer plants than we used to in this country, and we're an industrial society, but I'm sad for those that died. <clears throat> My point is, if four people got shot, it'd be the top news story, end of the world, ban all the guns, even though guns frustrate crime, 70-something times. The numbers vary from 44 to 100 and something, but on average, 70-plus times, guns stop crime for when they're used in a crime. In fact, criminals pretty much just sneak in houses that are vacant now or people aren't home and steal stuff out of your car if it's not locked uh, because everywhere with gun proliferation I mean you it's Russian roulette robbing somebody or conking some lady on the head because a lot of women don't listen to Gloria Steinem now a lot of women go out and buy guns and go out and get training and you try to rape them or rob them they're going to light you up light you up like Christmas <laughs> I just love seeing the culture of liberty proliferate as they try to force this tyranny in. And they saw the awakening happening in the last decade. So they came in hard with Obama to be their closer. And now he's looking at it and sees everybody waking up and he's just planning all these executive orders. And he thinks his Republican buddies over there, Boehner and McConnell, will be able to protect him from political backlash. Go ahead. Make my day, punk. Go ahead. Because it takes you guys acting like the tyrants you are nakedly to get the American people up off their patoots. I want to open the phones up in the next segment right through the next hour. Our reporters are joining us from Ferguson. That's just some of the news that's coming up today. Chicago schools teaching safe anal sex to fifth graders. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I didn't know there was a safe form of that. Unbelievable. It's like the Affordable Care Act ain't affordable. Or the Patriot acts the opposite of being a Patriot. Or they tell you, go ahead and wear a condom, and then you're going to be safe. You know how often condoms burst? You know how often people put condoms on wrong? And then there's nothing safe about that type of sex.
My goodness.